Guys, I know we have 21 days more to the big tournament African Cup of Nations coming up in every course, okay? So now it's getting closer and closer. So uh, be, before that, before you know, then uh, the, the tournament is here. I'm so excited that finally African Cup of Nations is coming back, you know, after uh, it was postponed uh, this year to uh, next year. So uh, the postponement bring another excitement bring another joy and another anticipation to the big tournament okay so i'll be telling you about the date that a black star players have been told to report to camp okay i'll be sharing with you and share other stories that i have here with you right now on this very channel okay so uh before we move and talk more don't forget as is you are youtubers our national anthem subscribe to the channel uh if today is your first time watching my video or if you've been watching the video and you haven't subscribed to my channel please i take god beg you can you this christmas festive season two uh, subscribe to the channel Hit the notification bell share the video to your friends like and also comment okay so facebook is bedu tv followers there instagram is bedu tv followers there tiktok actually tiktok there i keep changing my handle because i don't know what's wrong with tiktokers and our people there so tiktok is bedu tv6 so follow us and uh twitter and i said their friend x and also is bedu news tv so follow us on all the social media handles and uh, we will do uh, to follow you back where we need to follow back and also we will do uh, to like your like and like your like so kindly like the video share to your friends okay so now let me uh, tell you about this one okay uh, about the black stars and also other story that i have here right now with you as we have 21 days to the african cup of nations 2023 that will play in 2024 okay so okay so before i talk about uh, the reporting time and everything let me first of all talk about what uh karim zito the head coach of uh dreams fc you know he has urged the current black star players to do everything possible to repay ghana for the opportunity given to attain a guys a, a greater height of their careers okay so the black stars have been poor in recent tournaments suffering early elimination at the 2021 african cup of nations and also 2022 world cup in qatar okay so the team have faced uh, numerous of criticisms following their unimpressive performance in recent times okay so ghana will be competing for the uh, the most prestigious trophy in the world football this is one of the most prestigious trophy in the world of football that's the african cup of nations in the neighboring country at very coast okay as the search for the fifth uh, continental trophy continues okay however Karim Zito has lamented over the performance of black star players, emphasizing the need to sacrifice in order to repay the country. So this is what he said, okay. Our players have been performing at the club level but struggle with the national team. I will urge the players to sacrifice for themselves, for the nation, okay. And uh, as a footballer, once in your life, you will need to excel. Uh -huh. You need to excel. Uh, this is the sign right here. So uh, he continues to say that the country gave them a platform to attain a greater height in their career. So I think it is about time the players uh, show commitment, sacrifice for the country to show that they are, they are repaying the country for the opportunity given to them. So that is what Karim Zito, uh, the head coach for Dream FC, saying what i say you know, like everything he's saying is legit okay but let me give you one scenario that shows that yeah the, uh, the opportunity given to them to attain a greater height uh by the black stars is very important they need to repay ghana okay so you know english premier league before you play english premier league except you are european if you are not an european you have to play your national team at least 20 percent of a national team uh, matches before you can get opportunity to play in the premier league english premier league okay so all the Ghanaians playing in the english premier league that uh, they had opportunity to play for the senior national team there's a black start of ghana before they were bought into uh that's their club respective club in the uh, premier league for example kurus mohammed 
Thomas Ter party. Okay. So these guys they have to play Black Stars matches 20% before they got the opportunity to play. Okay. But Tariq Lamte and uh other player that's a uh Antoine Selem Semayon, you know, for them they were born as British, okay, before they switch nationality to play for Ghana. And aside that this is a party and also Kuris Mohamed. If you go to other clubs, there are a lot of uh, players that play in top top clubs before. Uh, that's a uh, because they play for Ghana, because they play for Black Star. For example, is uh, that is a former Black Stars player, Kevin Prince Boateng. You know, after uh, Kevin Prince Boateng, uh, Portmouth were uh, relegated, okay, uh, he was not having a club, but Ghana invited him to play at the 2010 World Cup, and after then. AC Milan bought him, and through that, also Barcelona bought him. So, the not the blast up, they need to show commitment, they need to uh, show something, they need to repay the country, Ghana, so that everybody will know that, yeah, uh, they too, they can do something uh, for the black stars of ghana okay so no uh karim zuto continues to say that uh they ought to work as uh, hard as they do for their various clubs if one watches the performance they exhibit at club level and comparing it to one they show in the black stars you might think they are here on holidays so charlie is true charlie is true you know if you watch these players playing the premier league playing in the bundesliga playing the uh, no La Liga and other big clubs in the Europe. Uh, you see how Kudus Mohamed, you see how Pate, you see how, uh, you know, Jujua caught them, you see how they kill themselves. But Charlie, uh, when they come to Ghana, as if they are <laughs> they are here to party, they play like a disco way, no commitment, you know, we just overhype them. So, Kami Zudo is saying that, Charlie, uh, if you come to Ghana, show something. We are not here on holidays, so you are here to play for blaster so you must play according to the instructions and what to, you must sacrifice for the black stars of ghana for the badge for the country for the flag okay so that is what karim zito is saying now you know uh the africa cup of nations starts on 13 january and end on 11th uh, february 2024 okay so black stars will open camp on that is a fourth january 2024 uh, okay so for january is when black stars will be opening camp so the players have been told to report to camp on that date even though the official squad has not yet been uh announced okay but those who who go to the tournament have been informed and uh they have told them to report on that as a fourth okay because 8 january ghana will play against botswana then after 8 january uh, that is a uh, 14th january also ghana will be playing against mozambique that is the first uh, game for ghana in the african cup of nations 2024 in africa so black star players have been told to Charlie repay Ghana and also they have been told to report to camp on time. So this is what Karim Zito is saying and this is the information that I have. These guys need to show commitment. They need to show something, Charlie. This is our time. They show, say, Charlie, I'm, I'm ready for Ghana. They, they are ready to die for the badge and the flag of Ghana. Let's meet another time. Bye-bye. For now.